How y'all doing today? Uh, been kind of bad weather this week. I'm here away at a lumber yard get my load, but what I want to talk to y'all about today is about if you're driving a box trailer and you're looking to get in the flatbed. Um, I talked to my recruiter uh, probably about a couple of days ago and uh, he explained it all to me, you know, pretty much if you a box driver, you got experience, or a refrigeration driver, whatever you got experience, or, or, or you basically got to be 22 years old and you want to convert to flatbed, where they got a training thing, which you have to do like a two week flatbed training. And uh, once you get that done, then you can start driving. You know, basically that's how it go. And then if you're 22, and you got your uh, CDLs. They got a six-week course for beginner drivers that you know, fresh out of school. So pretty much you will get, you will take a two-week uh, flatbed course, teach you how to scrap down, use your chains, and then you will go on the road with an OTR trainer for a couple of weeks if you're coming straight from out of school. So that, that's a good thing. So those are two things I want to kind of touch base on and uh, give an update on. Cause I, I get these questions and uh, some, a lot of times I couldn't really answer, you know, cause I hate to give an answer to somebody when I don't 100% know, I'd rather know. So uh, pretty much that's how that goes. So. PNS got everything on lockdown for uh, that go, and of course they won't have you out there unsafe, you know, so you can come in and get training, especially if you're on operator and you want to change from being a um, box trailer driver to flatbed, you can get the flatbed training, get the trailer or whatever, go on by your business, even if, you know, if that was you, if you was an owner operator, if you wanted to do a lease. But that's all I got for now. But, and if y'all got any more questions, just uh, leave it down there, you know, in the comment section. And uh, if you need to um, reach out and touch me or whatever, ask me some questions in private or whatever the case may be. Or either you want to call, want my recruiter to call and give you a. Uh, you know, give you the rundown, you know, that, that'd be, you know, that wouldn't be no problem either, you know, so I got all my uh, detailed information down there in the description, you know, my email or whatever, and I can give you the, my recruiter uh, phone number or whatever, he'll shoot straight, he pretty, you know, he's a pretty decent um, guy, so he won't be, you know, just telling you what you want to hear, he'll just tell you the truth and break it down, but alright, y'all be safe. Peace.